Paul George has decided to stay with the Oklahoma City Thunder by signing a four-year, $137 million deal. Uh, this is a shocking thing for me, uh, in, in my opinion, I should say, because everybody, including me, thought, hey, they couldn't do much in this season, so maybe that's it for Paul George in OKC if that one-year experiment is over. But maybe he's like, you know, let me give it another few years or so to see what has worked and what hasn't worked over the past year. What can we improve on? Can we win a championship? Can we go far overall? Those are the, the questions that the, you know, that maybe Paul George and the Oklahoma City Thunder have at this moment. I, I mean, if, again, like everybody thought, hey, He's going to the Lakers, you know, he's going to team up with with LeBron James and all that type of stuff. But, you know, right now, I think it's all about how Paul George can make things work with, with Russell Westbrook and OKC. I, uh, I'm not sure if Carmelo Anthony will be uh, part of the long-term plans when it comes to OKC's future. Maybe after next season, he will not, uh, he will not sign, re-sign with the Thunder and end up leaving to try to see if he can find more money. Remember, because this year he decided not to opt out and decided to opt into the contract, which is worth over $28 million. And he, I think he knows that he, that this is his last year in which he can obtain that amount of money because once his contract is, once his contract is expires like at best he will be worth like 20 million dollars at, at most and how and how much money there is for the NBA teams right now so you know the way I see it is you know Paul George decided to stay because he sees that things should be better in OKC maybe maybe it's just a player away from I don't know why he took that back shot. But anyways, uh, you know, maybe he sees that they're, they're either one player away from actually going further, or maybe they're, maybe there's a player out there, <coughs> Carmelo, I think, that, that might just be making them fall behind when they have the team to get things done. I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe he sees that there's bigger potential here than anywhere else to actually win. Let's see how things go in free agency. There's a lot more coming up. Just see you guys next time.